This is Electric Universe Eyes, and today I wanted to talk about black holes and the famed official photo of a black hole. I want to start out by quoting a gentleman. I'm going to leave his name out of this. But he says, quote, In my library, because I am older, I possess books. In one of these books are old facsimile photos of the plates from Mount Wilson, Palomar Observatory. Here is photo of M87 Sagittarius A, taken in the late 1980s at Mount Wilson, Palomar Observatory. It's an X-ray image showing a Birkeland current emitting plasma from its tip. That Birkeland current is 5,000 light years long, while M87 Sagittarius A is 50 light years across. Notice the plasma cloud emerging from the tip. That tells us that since late 1980s, astrophysicists have known M87 Sagittarius A is not a black hole. The law of conservation of mass and energy tells us that such an emission is a violation of black hole theory. I suspect Halton Arp took this photo. This also tells us that the object in the April 10, 2019 photo has a magnetic pole tilted roughly 15 degrees on the y-axis and roughly 30 degrees on the x-axis away from us. This explains the elliptical shape of the central, quote, blackness in that photo released on April 10th, as well as giving us insight into the algorithm used to create their photo. The redshift of a toroid close to us will appear more luminously shifted blue, while the far side will be less luminous redshifted to the infrared. In other words, EHT is exaggerating redshift calculations while photoshopping out the presence of a plasma-emitting Birkeland current, while also claiming the, quote, toroid, which they insist is what we see, is perpendicular to our frame of reference. This press release on April 10th was ghastly for its mendacious claims. Relativistic magnetohydrodynamics uses mendacious mathemagic called magnetic reconnection, which Hans Alvin proved to be a fallacy over 20 years ago. Polar plasma jets are a fabrication of Hawking acolytes to undermine the accomplishments of Langmuir and Alvin. Once it was demonstrated to Hawking that he was wrong, he pulled a Chapman move to appropriate Alfin's work and reword it as his own. Quote, traditional black hole depictions only appeared after these Halton art photos verified Birkeland, Langmuir, and Alfin. Here is another photo from Halton Arp's book. This picture of Harrow Herbig 34 by Bo Repurth shows a young star forming system in our own galaxy, HH34 in the combined light of sulfur and hydrogen emission. This is from the ESO Messenger number 88, June 1997, page 20. Note the resemblance to the jet in M87 in the preceding picture. Also, the outer ejections show similarities. The author adds Sagittarius A because that's what people read in the press release on April 10th. Most people are not astrophysicists nor astronomers. So these terms make sense in the context of the April 10th press release. EHT is attempting to claim that their inferences concerning M87 apply to Sagittarius A. The photos released on April 10th, quote, the first black hole ever photographed. What most people reading these press releases don't know is that April 10th marks the fourth time astronomers have claimed M87 Sagittarius A as a black hole. In three prior attempts to make this claim of the, quote, first black hole seen, scientists tinkered with the data until they arrived at their desired outcome. This resulted in no one in the scientific community lending credibility to such claims. Rather than present their findings to peers, this fourth time, scientists chose to use the, quote, court of public opinion, like Theresa May and the Brexit vote, quote, We'll seek a popular referendum to arrive at an esoteric result even after the voters voted, end quote. This photo is Supernova 1987A, 168,000 light years from Earth. This photo is M87 Sagittarius A. 
the one in the April 10th magical press release, which is 26,000 light years from Earth. There is no way you or I can know what we are looking at in either picture. That's precisely the nature of this particular machination. A picture is presented with a narrative, and we are left to trust that this fourth time, quote, we, the researchers, got our story straight, end quote. Let's be clear, this thing is 26,000 light years away from us. We're handed a photo plus narrative and expected to take their word for it. This fourth time, they involved a number of observatories in this gambit. The data was recently massaged by a single group at MIT. It turns out that M87 Sagittarius A is a celestial object upon which many astrophysicists hurl their imaginations. Many years ago, Professor R. C. Gupta at the Institute of Engineering and Technology in Lucknow, India, presented a fantastic theory in a paper entitled, Bending of Light Near a Star and Gravitational Red-Blue Shift, Alternative Explanation Based on Refraction of Light. I'll put this link in the description. The paper, which asserts that the theory behind gravitational lensing, one of the evidentiary, quote, proofs of general relativity, is wrong. Not only is Sagittarius A not a black hole, but the gravitational lensing effect was proven to be hopelessly wrong. The lensing effect is caused by refraction through the atmospheres of stars and galaxies. What the paper did prove, however, is that mathematics can be used to capture imaginations with fallacy. Dr. Edward Doherty Jr., a physicist and laser optics engineer formerly with the NASA Goddard Space Flight Center, derived the mathematical solution for, quote, lensing using refraction instead of gravity. Remarkably, Gupta's paper goes on to postulate that gravitational attraction is only between gravitational bodies, bodies with mass, suggesting that light waves have no mass, so cannot be affected by gravity. The long-held assumption of general relativity that the speed of light C is constant, is also challenged by Dowdy's theory. As is the cause of gravitational red and blue shift in light witnessed from distant galaxies. These ideas are also predicated on refraction because the energy of light is not changed by refraction. Why is M87 Sagittarius A an object of fascination? It's like the drunk looking for his keys under a street light because the light is better. This object hasn't any stars or dust between us and it. It's under the streetlight. In other words, wait for peer review of the quote, magical first black hole discovered for the fourth time. I am not confident this will survive peer review. Here are the papers over the last 11 years claiming M87 Sagittarius A is a black hole 26,000 light years from Earth, as well as the plurality of peer reviewed papers declaring quote, we have a black hole. All of these links will be in the description, including the one from 2018 on phys.org, where the EHT is teaching us how they intend to formulate the images of M87 Sagittarius A as a black hole, with no evidence it is a black hole. Between you and I, I believe our universe is electric, and that Birkeland currents connect the entirety of the cosmos. So we shall see Let's see how this turns out.